Praise God. The Gospel according to St. Luke chapter 17, reading from verses 11 through 19. Luke chapter 17, reading from verses 11 through 19. Luke 17, 11 through 19. And it came to pass as he went to Jerusalem that he passed through the midst of Samaria and Galilee. And as he entered into a certain village, there met him ten men that were lepers, which stood afar off. And they lifted up their voices and said, Jesus, Master, have mercy on us. And when he saw them, he said unto them, Go show yourselves unto the priest. And it came to pass as they went, they were cleansed. And one of them, when he saw that he was healed, turned back and with a loud voice glorified God. And fell down on his face at his feet, giving him thanks, and he was a Samaritan. And Jesus answered, Ray, saying, Were there not ten clans? But where are the nine? They are found, they are not found that return to give glory to God, save the stranger. And he said unto him, Arise, go thy way, thy faith hath made thee whole. Hallelujah. Father, in the name of Jesus, we just want to thank you for your word tonight. And I pray now in the name of Jesus, as your words are about to go forward, that God, one more time, you would answer life and praise. I pray that the power of the Holy Ghost will take full control right now, full divine authority, in the name of Jesus. And as your words tonight will go forth with clarity, with power, with wisdom, and with might. We look to you, Lord, in the name of Jesus. Thank you for restoring my vocal cords tonight. I thank you that it is already done. In the name of Jesus. Let the church say amen. Let the church say amen. amen. Hallelujah. Of course, I honor the theme prepared to meet thy God. Amen. And whatever we do or say, the say, uh, center in that theme. Hallelujah. Just turn to your neighbor and say, neighbor, yeah. or neighbor, oh, neighbor. Be, grateful. be grateful. Say it one more time. Neighbor, yeah. or neighbor, yeah. Be grateful. Be grateful. Uh, amen. That's what I would like to talk about tonight. Very simple subject. Be grateful. Tell your neighbor again, be grateful. Be grateful. Hallelujah. Amen. amen. Now giving thanks for being grateful is an important attitude if we want to be happy. But unfortunately, there are many of us who don't do so well at being grateful. As a matter of fact, there are some folks who it doesn't matter what you have done for them, they will not stop to say thank you. Can I get a witness here? About happy preaching here tonight. Ungratefulness and ingratitude. 
loose tonight. Pray for me, Phil.
and I'm thankful to God. All God is doing for them, they act as if he's doing nothing. You're not here. Let's go! 
family that we into them. Because we are here and we are there. We want to talk with the official. We are here and we are not here to enjoy the place.
And I went on my way. Yeah, to the river. When I came back home and I asked my wife, how did you do you mean? Did you know that God provided for her too? I want to speak properly because I know you said it. You see, I love you, I love you, I love you. You can't satisfy completely.
35 years and they have never proposed. Come on. 
was a contagious disease. Yes. Second, leprosy was a disease which the Jews would inflict for the punishment of some of our sins. Amen. That's how dangerous leprosy was. Yes. That they used to inflict it for the punishment of other sins. Thirdly, leprosy was also seen as a mark of God's displeasure. However, yes. oh, Jesus particularly took care of leprosy every time it came across him. So we have that physical leprosy tonight. But we have some that is spiritual, spiritual leprosy. Somebody says spiritual leprosy. Talk. Come on, talk. You don't sleep. We are up with your sacrum. Hallelujah. Even some of us have spiritual leprosy. Even what Jesus has an interest in cleansing you tonight. Oh, we're in with that Jesus. Ah, he's taking particular interest in you tonight. Leprosy. 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 So 